Hello everyone, this is Saad Ahmed and in this video, we are going to learn how to create a landing page in Adobe Illustrator. Once you design the landing page in Adobe Illustrator, you can transform it into WordPress as well. Okay, to proceed, first of all, we have created uh, an artboard of size 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel. That is the standard size of the landing page. And now after that, I have chosen few color palettes here, uh, which I will use during the course of this video. And uh, there are set many websites that you can use to, to fetch color combinations if you are not good at it. One of the website is coolers.co that I normally use in order to find these awesome color combinations. Okay, now we are proceeding. First of all, select the rectangle tool and create a rectangle in the artboard that will be basically the background of the landing page okay first you have created the rectangle go to windows and gradient tab that is already open and select colors click on this button and then color picker tool and simply click on this one okay now hold on shift key and just drag it so it will create another color and then go, uh, using the color picker tool you can select the next color in the same way you can add one more color and by using the color picker tool we can select the next one and we can proceed like this okay now change the angle to minus 90 degree so this is the background of the landing page that we will be using we can make some adjustment as well okay now i'm locking this layer now go grab the pen tool with the shortcut p and create right angle triangle like this okay and now using the eyedropper tool with the shortcut i click on this button and click on the color that you want to apply on this specific shape like this now again select the pen tool and start drawing some trees and now select both shapes Control g to group this object as one and go to object transform and reflect and select copy okay now you can reduce its size like this and can bring this object to the top and can change the color just to differentiate between the bottom layer you can increase the height okay we can reduce the height of the existing one and okay now i am going to create a few mountains in the background to give it some a professional look so i am logging these layers and grabbing the uh, to log the layers you can use the shortcut control plus two and now i'm i have grabbed the pen tool with the shortcut key p and drawing few mountains okay now we have created three additional shapes over the mountain and the life has been made easier with the help of shape builder tool that is here in the panel and you can select the shape builder tool by with the shortcut shift plus m okay now as you can see we can add the shape and separate the shape so if we want to separate the unnecessary parts simply click alt so the plus sign will be transformed into negative sign and just click on it so it will remove the unnecessary part like this like this like this okay now this was the base of the background the base of the mountain and we can apply some good gradient over these colors in order to remove 
any color from the gradient simply drag it from there so it will be removed and uh, let's change few colors of the gradient click on this color select color picker tool and choose choose the lightest one that is the this one and now select the middle one color picker tool and change color to this now it is giving some nice effect change this one as well to give it a lighter color okay we can adjust the gradient with the handles we can change the angle to 45 okay and select both shapes select eyedropper tool and click on it so all the colors will be applied on this now it has given it is giving a shape of the mountain and looking better select this and select horizontal align center to align the object in the center okay now i'm unlocking all these layers with the shortcut all all control and 2 okay and click this shape and the background and select the uh, option to send all the layers at the back control shift and left the square bracket so i have sent the selected layers at the back like this we can reduce down the size of the mountain like this okay and like this it is giving a very nice effect right now okay now let's add some text using the text box with a shortcut t uh, let's say welcome to design with Saad Ahmed select all align center increase the size change the color change the font horizontal align center and put the main text here and you can also reduce the size of the main text for adjustment okay now select one go to rectangle tab and rounded rectangle tool and create one rounded rectangle and select the color of like this yeah and make it horizontal center we can make the duplicate of this layer to place the text beneath it so what we have to do we have to select this text and keep on pressing the alt key and simply drag it so it will create a duplicate layer here you can write the text we can make it lighter we can reduce the size as well and place in the middle of this control shift and right square bracket to bring the layer to the top okay like this okay now few more buttons to be placed as you see in the landing page so we have to reduce the size more like this and here i am going to write let's say home keep on pressing the alt key and drag it here now to repeat the same pattern click ctrl plus d ctrl plus d so it will create multiple text and we can adjust with the help of text tool we can edit the text products about contact like this and we can adjust it okay now another thing for the menu button select the rounded rectangle and create bars like this and keep on pressing the alt key like this and control d to make the duplicate now select the direct selection tool with the shortcut a and select this handle and do like this and group these objects okay we can 
reduce its size as well and we can adjust the position as well so it is giving a very nice effect as far as uh, my opinion is concerned and the last thing that we have to do here is to place the logo so I have already placed my logo in the artboard and obviously you can place the logo that you want and by duplicating the layer you can add any text for instance I write your logo okay and this is giving me a very good feel of a landing page 